Once again, we're here on South Holston Lake with Corey Nice, FLW Touring Pro. And Corey, today we're talking about swim baits. That's and right. the swim baits, uh, pretty much, I fished them all year round. Absolutely. You know, yeah. this, uh, this right here is actually, this is a 3.8 inch Kytec. And right. this right here, this swim bait, you can take this all over the country and catch fish on it. I mean, it's a bait that... It is a universal can, bait. It is. You can yeah. throw this all over the country. I mean, all times of the year out here, especially out here around East Tennessee area, you know. This right here is a bait that catches a bunch of fish. And as well, they make the smaller ones too. Right. This right here is a 3.3 inch Kytec. Right. And, now, I've uh, caught some smallmouth on those before. Yeah, they yeah. they absolutely tear. They'll this eat thing it out. up. Yeah, they and really even, will. They even make one that's a little bit small. This is a 2.8 inch Kytec. And these baits right here, they, there's so many fish to get caught on these baits around here. Yeah, I was going to tell you too. You know, we be, we talk about bass fishing so much, but yeah. I've actually caught crappie on on that smaller yeah, version right they there. Will. <laughs> They'll eat it up if they're around. <laughs> just just about any kind of fish that eats a yeah. shad will eat these baits right absolutely. here. Absolutely. They look just like them. You know, I mean. And surprisingly enough, mm -hmm. you know, you can come out here in the dead middle of summer. Right. I mean, hot, you hot, know, yeah. but, and throw this. Just, I mean, just because it looks exactly like what they eat, they eat it no matter what on yeah. your round. And, you know, it doesn't, it, they think it's a shad, but it's really, it doesn't really look like a shad to us, but no. to the fish, it, that's that's part of their forage, Absolutely. what they're going you after. Know, they just, it's got a real good action. Mm -hmm. And even, you know, I mean, you can get up to a big swim bait. It's like five and six inch swim right. baits. They eat those, you know, because these fish around here, they'll eat big shad. I and mean, you said, do. you just toss it out there and work it back just real, just bump it along real slow. Yeah, you, you know, you throw it as far as you can throw it normally. Yeah. Yeah. And sometimes you got to let it hit the bottom and just right. slow roll it all the way yeah. back to the boat. Sometimes you throw it out there and you just want, you're trying to catch suspended fish that are right. Up, so you got to, as soon as it hits the water, you know, you're starting to crank it. Right. Sometimes you got to work it a little bit slower, you know, kind of bump it off the bottom. It just depends on what mood the fish are in is really what the main thing is. And isn't that always the case? It you, is. It, whatever, whatever bite yeah. mood the fish are in, you got to, you got to go to them. That's right. And it's, it's usually different every day, you know, <laughs> but you know, sometimes they're on the bottom, sometimes they're suspended, but it just really depends on the water temperature and what time of year it is really. All right. But swim bait, good, yeah. good bait year round. Absolutely. You can catch them on it all year round. All right, Corey, appreciate it, buddy. Yeah. Another great fishing tip here on daytime. Tri-Cities.